if you ride in tennis shoes, if you, anything bigger than a moped, stop it. Yeah, you need stop to have it. boots on. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we just want to give you some uh, budget friendly adventure riding gear options that you can uh, use and not have to spend a lot of money to do so. The stuff we use, same things might not work exactly for you, but uh, to get you started and get you in the right direction. I use a ZR1 range helmet, as you can see there. That's uh, the camouflage, red and gray camouflage. One. It's like 150 bucks, DOT approved. Uh, been a pretty good helmet. The fit is a little bit weird, but all that all depends on the shape of your head, so just get what works best for you. I also just use a cheap pair of built uh, from Cycle Gear gloves. They've been working pretty good, got a good bit of miles on them, they ain't showing no signs of ripping or tearing. HWK jacket and pants. Uh, these gloves, by the way, are about $20 to $30, depending on what kind of sales they got going on. These textile jacket and pants uh, from HWK, like six, stuff. yeah, 60, 60, maybe $70, depending on Amazon's deal, but you can find it all on Amazon. Um, I wear motocross boots, fly Maverick boots. Uh, I got Sudici helmet, Sudici boots, venture boots. So, uh, and same, I, same jacket, pants, just different All that stuff's about the uh, same price. So 100 bucks for the helmet, about 100 bucks, maybe 150, depending on the sales they got going on. Yeah. Um, can't say nothing bad about this gear. Now, if you ride in tennis shoes, if you, anything bigger than a moped, stop it. Yeah, you need stop to have it. boots on. Uh, I don't know why you'd want to. A 500 pound motorcycle falling on your foot wouldn't feel good, and I definitely don't want to do it. Might stop you riding too. Yeah, yeah, it might, yeah, especially if you're going on a big adventure. That simple can yeah. do a lot of help. I agree with that. Like you might fall down and break your ankle, then on day one, there goes your whole ride. I ain't saying you can't do it with motocross boots on or a, or a thicker adventure boot. Less likely to happen. Yeah. But riding in some dad New Balance Nikes or something, like, stop that, man. You know, like, stay in your backyard. I don't know, yeah, I don't even care if you got a 300cc bike, whatever bike you ride, like, don't go out riding that. Use, use a little better sense and always put your gear on. It's important. And you might be hot sometime. This jacket, I wouldn't wear it above 70 degrees because it is hot, but get you some other type of jacket. Just use protection. Um, just like safe sex, do safe riding. You know what I mean? Right. Have you, don't want to have, you don't want to have unnecessary babies. This makes it better. You don't this want to have unnecessary better. damage on your body either, That's especially right. when you get older like us. So use your protection. Save you some money. Like I said before, there's always... Well, I want to save money. Put put gas in your tank. Go on some bigger adventures. That's what it's all about. Ride more. It ain't about buying a five hundred dollar jacket or five hundred dollar uh, pants and a twenty thousand dollar bike to go have fun. You can do all this stuff for three or four thousand dollars, maybe five. That's right. And go out in there and have fun. That's your camping gear and everything. So, y'all stay safe out there. Thanks for watching. Yep. Appreciate it.